Hello and welcome. Today we are looking at some of the scriptures that have inspired the writing of the songs by APC Music. I don't know if you've heard the song In Your House and this has been inspired by Psalm 27. Um, psalm 27 is a, is a wonderful psalm. It talks about the fact that uh, the Lord is the psalmist's light and salvation. Whom shall I fear? The Lord is the strength of my life. Of whom shall I be afraid? And so on. It, it, it goes on to say, though an army comes around me or when I'm surrounded by the army, when, when, uh, when I'm fearful, my heart shall not fear because in this I will be confident. One thing I have desired. Now this is beautiful. No. The psalmist says, one thing I have desired of the Lord. And what is that one thing? It says, this one thing I will seek. That I will dwell in the house of the Lord. That I, I may adore and look and inquire the beauty of the Lord. And, uh, and to inquire in His temple. So he's talking about being in the presence of God. Being surrounded by worship. And he's saying, this one thing I will seek. This one thing I will desire, you, O oh God, despite everything that's happening around. Okay. So the Lord, the presence of the Lord is our rock, our refuge, is our strong tower. The psalmist also says, and he talks about the goodness of God. You know, the goodness of God, the grace of God. And one of the other things, thoughts that inspired the song is also uh, the prodigal son and how he is wasted, is living and he turns around and he, he's looking and he wants to go back home. He's walking with all this apprehension and all these fears and anxieties. Will he be accepted? Will he be welcomed? You know, uh, will he be rejected and so on? He's, he's walking and in the distance he sees the father or rather the father sees him and he runs towards the son. And uh, with arms open wide, he welcomes him to the house. He welcomes him back. He restores him. And there's rejoicing and there's dancing and there's celebration. There's so much security and strength in the house of God, in the presence of God, in the dwelling place of God. That is something that we see. So the goodness of God, the grace of God, the mercy of God, let's receive it. Let's believe, let's receive Let's go back and it is our strength, our sure foundation. And uh, towards the end of the psalm, um, it says, wait on the Lord. The psalmist says, wait on the Lord, be of good courage and he shall strengthen your heart. Now, when we wait on the Lord, our strength is renewed. When we wait on the Lord, our vision is renewed. That fire is rekindled. And that song, the song, and this psalm, okay, sorry, and this, and this song talks about and leads us into waiting on the Lord. So today, wait on the Lord, meditate on, uh, on His word, and get back to His presence and desire this one thing, and may you experience His power, His presence in an amazing way. God bless. In your house, I will live forevermore, singing, praising, dancing, Lord, my Savior. In your house, I am safe and secure, my rock, my tower, Lord, you are my shelter. My rock, my tower, Lord, you are my shelter. Thank you for tuning in to Living Supernaturally. For more resources to strengthen your spiritual walk, please visit apcwo.org.